investing in our core, investing in our community, being deliberate in uh, how our downtown turns out and what kind of investment we want to see driven here. Uh, as we have a train going by so appropriately right now and celebrating our history of why we are, are here in the first place in this valley and why we are a community. Uh, celebrating our CP and uh, being right next, next to the tracks obviously are a part of that. But uh, council really wanted to identify this area and be specific and deliberate in how this investment uh, could look and model uh, for future investment. We're going to have a transit function here all along, but uh, this council had the wherewithal to say, well, what else? What else could happen? Uh, yes, we're going to build a, a transit building. Yes, it's going to have a transit function. Colt's going to work, and we delivered on that uh, service. And yes, we have some work to do, and we're going to uh, improve that service every year. Uh, but we really wanted to look at how we can leverage that opportunity into what else. Um, and what else is what we're standing in. Not only just a transit function, but also a uh, innovation center behind us for a uh, future business incubator. Uh, we have visitor information services here where we're standing today. We've obviously got the, uh, the transit function. Uh, and there's Councillor Wilson. Come on up. Perfect timing. Um, but I think it's important we talk about a little bit about the history. So there was over on the kind of park side of the property that is now covered in snow, but will be a future skating area in the winter time. Um, in the future, probably not this year, but in future years. We're gonna have a, an area for, for residents to gather. Uh, Maple, right downtown, the connection on the other side of the tracks with the, uh, the crossing, of course. But we had, had envisioned a three-story building uh, a few years ago. Uh, it was came to fruition from a trip to Waterloo when a few of us were at FCM. We stopped in Toronto on the way home. Uh, looked at some uh, incubator spaces in, in Ontario where they've been modeling this for well over a decade and said, well, why can't we do something similar in Cochrane? So that was kind of the, the idea. Five, four, three, two, one.